So in the last video we showed you guys a lot about how the control stick works with dribble moves and um, the control stick's also used for shooting this year. So if you hold down the left trigger, the, the right stick becomes a shot stick like last year. There's an option to flip that, but we really encourage all you guys just to try out the control stick the way that it's set up uh, default in the game right now. Once you master it, it really is uh, just a way better way to play the game. On offense, when you're getting crowded, you can push the control stick away from the defender if you wanted to protect that ball. Same thing Kobe would do in real life. If you push a control stick towards the defender, you can kind of give the defender a little nudge, um, create that space, something that Paul Pierce would normally do in game. There's a bunch of things that people really didn't like with uh, 2K12. Um, speed was one thing. Bigger defenders guarding smaller guys really come through now so that you definitely feel like, hey, I can break this dude down or break this defender down because I have a mismatch here. Guys move properly in the right speed and, and um, you know, the big guys are slower, by, like they can't launch as fast to, to a lateral slide as a, a smaller, quicker guard. Change the mechanics around. When the dribbler changed its mechanics, we changed the mechanics in the post a little bit too to kind of mimic it. And we feel like we got a lot more balance in, in, uh, in the low post moves. So this year we kind of went back to the drawing board again, used the new dynamic shot generation technique technology and retooled our physics engine to make sure that when you go up and you get hit, you see the proper collision between the offensive guy and the defensive guy. And the cool thing about it is when you get into the air or as you're landing, you'll always see something different when you attack the basket. So you'll see guys you know, go up strong, you might get clobbered by a blocker, come down, wipe out. You'll see a lot more contact dunks, a lot more falls, a lot, a lot more cool stuff you know, in the air. You, you know, if it's a really hard hit, he'll, like, he'll grab his head like, oh, he's, he's hurt or he'll grab his limb, he might get, you know, he'll be out of the play for a little bit. So there's all kinds of interactions and all kinds of different sequences that can play out. One of the big complaints was um, going on a fast break and always throwing the ball to that last defender even though you had three wide open guys. And so we figured out a bunch of uh, ways of getting bounce passes into the game. You guys are really going to enjoy the game this year. 2K13 is our best game yet. Mates with the Gasol. Oh! Call it game time and bang time. <laughs>